All right, uh, Sports Animals coverage of Thunder Media Day continues. Gideon Hamilton, Bobby Thompson. We're joined by Jeremiah Robinson Earl. Jeremiah, thanks for stopping by. Appreciate it. What was your summer like? Oh, it was great. You know, I was here a lot for uh, just eight weeks of, of training leading up to summer league, and then we got into summer league for it in Utah and Vegas, and then we had about a month and a half kind of on our own time, and I went back to Kansas City and was training, just enjoying my time there. So it was a good summer. Talk about now coming in your – almost a veteran on this young team now. So, you know, a young veteran on this team. But talk about what it's like going through this again as opposed to going through it the first time. I mean, there's just like – there's just less pressure going into this next season. I feel like having that first year under your belt really really helps a lot. You know, you can't simulate the NBA. Right. So, experience is just so important. So, I feel like it was almost the best way just for us last year, a lot of young guys just kind of thrown into the fire and just learning through experience. So I think that's going to help us a lot for next season. It, there was something that happened in the middle of last year. Um, you went over to the blue for a game. We went for like 25, 26 and 10 or something like that. And uh, Coach D talked about that and uh, how that was just meant to uh, – what, what purpose that served for you moving forward. I wonder if you could talk about that event because when you came back, it seemed like uh, you did play with a lot more uh, confidence, more assertiveness after that happened. I feel like it was one of the more – like obviously every, every game is important, but I feel like that was an important part of my career, especially for my rookie season, just, just showing it doesn't matter what the circumstances are or what's going to happen that – I'm going to give it my all for the team and play the way I play, not because I'm, I am I, I was on the uh, G League team that I'm going to play differently how I play in an NBA game, but just being able to just do everything I can to win a game. You, you play on this Thunder team with you know guys like Giddy and Shea. And Dor- you know, everybody talked about the guards, mm-hmm. you know, very guard-heavy team. Talk about the front court on this team, what you can ex- what the Thunder fans can expect from the front court you know, helping those guards out mm-hmm. and trying to put a successful product on the court. Yeah, there's just a, there's a lot of versatility from the front court. Just we're not the six eleven, seven foot big guys that are just banging under the goal. But there's a lot of versatility being able to guard one through five, being able to stretch the floor out to make it harder on the offense. So I think that's just something really dynamic we have for the team, and that it's really we have a lot of versatility. It hey, last one for you after you came back from the injury. Uh, toward the latter part of the season, got some minutes, played really, really well. Felt like a springboard into next uh, this season. Yeah, no, I think every every experience you can get in the NBA can really just help your career. And I feel like me being able to come back and finish those games after being hurt really kind of propelled me going into the summer, feeling confident about where I'm at. Really, especially coming off the injury, so I think that was a really, really good part of the end of the season. Way it was a really great way to end the season going into the summer. Good luck this year, man. Appreciate we appreciate it. it. Thanks.